where was Melania? She was absent from the first big black tie event of the pre-inauguration hoopla. The president-elect was there. I think we're gonna have record crowds coming. So was top aide Kellyanne Conway, looking glamorous in a one-shoulder winter white dress with a fur stole. Veep-to-be Mike Pence danced with his wife Karen. But no Melania. She stayed behind here at Trump Tower in New York. Melania is expected to fly down to D.C. on Thursday with her husband and the rest of the Trumps. She'll stay through the weekend and then will reportedly return here to Trump Tower on Sunday night in time for the start of her 10-year-old son Barron's school week. White House historian Kate Anderson Brower. She's put her foot down and said she's not going to move to Washington immediately because of their son. But I do think that eventually she'll feel the pressure to move to Washington, to live in the White House, because it's what the American people expect of a first lady. A writer for USA Today is catching some heat for an article titled, To Be or Not to Be a First Lady. According to Melinda Henneberger, there are lots of ways to do the job, or as Melania Trump is showing, not to do it at all. So, what will Melania wear on Inauguration Day? Women's Wear Daily reports it's likely to be Ralph Lauren, which she wore on election night. Karl Lagerfeld is also said to be a frontrunner. In his interview with Fox and Friends, the president-elect was asked about designer Tom Ford, who has said he wouldn't dress Melania. Did she even ask Tom Ford? Uh, never asked Tom Ford. Uh, doesn't like Tom Ford. Doesn't like his designs. Tom Ford is an example. I will not dress the first lady. He was never asked to dress. And Steve Wynn just called me, and he said he thought it was so terrible what Tom Ford said that he threw his clothing out of his Las Vegas hotel. Turns out it's true. We went to the Wynn Las Vegas hotel and look, shelves that once held Tom Ford products sit empty. Lots of ladies who want to look great for the ball but don't want to spend thousands of dollars are flocking to rent the runway, says stylist Damian West. This dress is by Badgley Mishka. A uh, beautiful fuchsia retails for $900, rents for just $140. This is from Nakon. It has an attached skirt panel, so you get that elevated feel to really take this up a notch. It retails for $900, but you can rent it for $100. Red is expected to be the color of the night. Of course, because it is speaking to the color of the winning party.